Okay, so yesterday I sent you out a reminder, everybody, and I said a couple things we'd look over today, and one of them is a vision that uh, Paul had just, uh, I don't know when exactly, but it was a vision about uh, how heaven processes two different kinds of prayers or conversations, and one of them is the petition prayer and the other is decrees. And this is a, a pretty good visual, and I think that I'm going to use a whiteboard here in a second after Paul kind of walks through this. And uh, I'd like to just create a little bit of a visual of what that may look like. So, uh, Paul, if you don't mind, would you just talk that through and what that looked like? Okay, before I start, I just I want to say that one of the things that I learned through these meetings is that if I cherish each individual manifestations of his presence, I can go back to them and I get more out of them. Every single time I get more out of them. And this particular vision that I had, I had written down and I went to reread it. And, uh, so I probably got a little bit more than when I shared it with you. And, and basically I was taken to heaven and, and this happened. Usually Jesus is the one who does it. He takes me and takes me to a room. This time an angel took me to this room and it was, it was full of other angels. Just how, don't know how long or big the room was. It seemed immensely to me. And uh, there were tables with iPads on them. That's what I thought. That's the only way that I can describe it. But they were three-dimensional. And that means that they, you could reach your hand into the screen and you would be able to take, see that red flower back there? You could reach into that red flower, grab a hold of it, the angel could, and it would end up in his hand. It was, it was, it was real. And I turned to the angel who was kind of my host and I said, what are they doing? And he said, these are petition prayers that, and this I'm adding to what he said then of hope. And uh, as he said that another angel came, took the particular petition that the person had and went into an adjoining room and in that room there were boxes and boxes of incubating boxes that they would put the prayer into that I believe kept them alive so they were they were there and they were being nurtured and that room also had angels on iPads three-dimensional and before I could ask him, he said, this room is full of decrees from earth, of faith. And when the angel receives the decree with faith, he reaches and pulls it out and unites it with the one in the incubation. And then he puts it back into it and it manifests on earth. I love that. Um, so first of all, uh, uh, well, you, maybe I'll just skip here to the whiteboard if I can find it. Here it is. Let me just see if I can, uh, make a graphic. So here's the earth and here we got, are you guys seeing that? Yep. Okay. And so, yeah. Okay. And so here we got heaven, and here's this big room, and there's angels there. Oh, shoot. Crazy. <laughs> Crazy thing jumps around sometimes. I don't know why it does that. Uh, let me just get out of this just a second. I'm still uh, trying to make this thing work for me. So we'll see how this works. So here's the earth. Here's the people. Here's heaven. Here's that room. 
here's angels and they got iPads and these are petition. And these are the prayers that are going up. Now it looks like according to Paul's deal that there's another room over here and an angel brings that over. And then there's all these incubators they got all these petition prayers waiting maybe on fullness of time or whatever. But there's some other angels over here. And they got other iPads that are for the decrees. Yeah, whatever. Kind of hard to write with your finger. But here, my feeling is, yeah, there's saints on earth, but they've learned how to ascend. I'm going to add this little part in there from my perspective, Paul, is we've learned how to get the mind of Christ, to get in the mind of Christ. We're beginning to agree with God. And the angel says, okay, we had a, a petition prayer come up from someone. Let's find someone who will agree with the mind of Christ. And then we partner with an angel. Angel goes over and says, hey, it's time to get that petition and now it's time to decree it down into the earth. Now, I don't know, Paul, if that's uh, anything like you saw, but when I read your uh, uh, text, I, that's the picture that came alive to me. And I feel like visuals help us to uh, not just assimilate it, but then to lean in with it. Does that make any sense to you, first of all, Paul? Yeah, it makes sense. But... Um... I can remember what it looks like from the vision. <laughs> and this is good, though. And the thing that about it is that between these two rooms, there's an open door. I think it's really important to know that they're, they're, it's not way down off someplace else. It's just right next door. And these angels, they know where to look to get what they need. So what helped me with this, and guys that are ready for comments, and then we'll move on after that, but uh, it helped me that uh, we have petitions going up on one hand, and these are from people that probably don't understand the magnitude, the, the, the benefit, the favor of the mind of God for them. So they're still in ask mode. They're good prayers. Right. They're from good people, from good hearts. And so they really register in heaven on these iPads. And the angels, they know what to do with it. They put it in this incubation room for the fullness of time and the right time. And then they're waiting for more mature saints who can get the mind of Christ to begin to partner with heaven to release it. So that both petition and decrees are valuable. And uh, God knows the perfect administrative <laughs> oversight <laughs> to make them both uh, work together. I would also add that I personally believe that that one person on earth could do all of those. They could ask for the petition, they could hear from God, they could agree with him, and they could make the same decree, and it's, it would still work. Cool. Any comments on that?